how to create items and set up variations in Square Online. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to set up items or create items into your Square Online within just a few seconds. So we are going to head over squareup.com, sign in for an account, and then we're going to see this dashboard. Once we are going to be here, we are going to head over the dashboard of the website, which is going to be located on the online here item. Select from here on this menu online store and wait for a few seconds. Once you have here the website uh, ready and uh, waiting for you, basically we are going to have um, a little bit of items or another menu to show up. So for the left side of the screen, we are going to have the other menu. We're going basically to click on items, click on site items, just like that. Now, what are we going to do? Basically, it's going to be very simple. We're going to wait for the items to load up. We can see our items here. So we want to create a, the a new item, right? So we are going to click on the blue button here, create item. Now we're going to have the item. Uh, so we can go ahead and set up the item type by changing it. Maybe you are going to have physical goods, for example, which is going to be including shippings, prepared food and beverage, for example, for um, maybe a pickup or delivery. Uh, we have the events, digital products, donations, other, whatever you want. So make sure that you're going to choose the right one for you. Now you are going to put the name of the product, a description, some images in here. I, I need to set up not any color, but an image because it is going to be uh, very important here. So we are going to maybe add this watch. So we can go ahead and add more images from here by clicking on upload or search from the library. So you are going to have the variation of the images. Now you can add some categorization for the categories. Uh, maybe I'm going to have this one or not. Now for the variation, which is going to be represented with the options. You're going to click on add and set up the option name. So we are going to have maybe, uh, let's say here, color, or since it is going to be a watch, so maybe we are going to have a color. So we are going to create color. Display name is going to be the same. So for the color option, we can go ahead and start adding the options that we want. For example, here we are going to type in gray. This is the first one. You can add another color. Maybe we are going to have black, and maybe we are going to have red something like that and then you can go ahead and add another option or set of options maybe we're going to add uh, here size for example we're going to have size like that maybe you are going to have a 44 millimeter maybe you are going to have 40 millimeter like that and etc so we are going to have everything set up you're going to be only creating the variation that you have created so they are going to be under two names, one under the color and one under the size. And as you can see, this is the option of the variation for the product. Basically, you can go ahead and add images for each one of the variation that you have added and you can go ahead and select them. You can update the images, and also update the price for them. So if you're going to make them here for the weight like this, you can go ahead and manage the stock for each one of them. And also you can go ahead and modify maybe the GTIN, SQ codes, prices. I'm going to put the price maybe for 140 for all. So it is going to be like that. So 140 for that. So it is going to be like this. You can edit uh, the stock tracking, manage the stock like this. And here we have it. That was pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you on the next one.